Hey guys, for Godzilla Final Wars here, and today this is another Attack on Titan OC talk. So, today we're going to be talking about um, a character who owns the Ultimate Titan form. And that is, of course person who owns the form goes by the name of Jason, a name that was suggested by Super Burning Godzilla. Anyways, without further ado, let us begin with this prof. Let's go over Jason, shall we? So Jason Kruger, he is the owner of the Ultimate Titan form. He is a proud Marleyan, but he chooses to stay in parody, mainly because of his love interest, Mikasa Arkerman. Now, Jason kind of looks like Aaron Yeager. People actually say that he's like Aaron's twin brother or something. But there's a key difference. Jason is just slightly taller than Aaron. He's also a bit more experienced when using his Titan form. And he's a lot more uh, stronger when it comes to close to close combat. Now, for his family numbers, his family numbers are Gabby, his little sister, and for his mother, his mother is Pink, the cart titan. Now, if you're wondering how did he fall in love with Mikasa, Mainly because when Aaron started to, well, started his little attack on Marley. Um, like Liberia, I think that's what that town was called. Um, when Jason showed up to the scene, he met Aaron, and of course he fought him, but when... He got shot by a Thunder Spear, which, of course, I kind of forgot to mention this, but, um, the Ultimate Titan's armor is, like, ten times stronger than the, um, Armored Titan's armor. So, yeah, that's what I forgot to mention. Oh, and also he can kind of remind, sort of. So, and he can also kind of talk in his Titan form. So, yeah. That's what I forgot to mention. Anyway, moving on. Back to Jason. <laughs> so, when Jason got shot by the Thunder Spear, obviously it did no damage. But he wanted to check to see who kind of shot him. And, of course, he saw Mikasa. And he was in love in first sight. Even though it was it's kind of forbidden for a Marleyan to fall in love with the Devil of Paradis. But Jason couldn't help himself. And plus, there's a little secret. He's also half parody. His father went by the name of... Jack Kruger? Yeah, Jack. And... Sorry about that. Anyways, moving on. And eventually, Pink found out that Jack was a Marley. Was not a Marleyan. But said a devil of parody, but she kept it a secret. 
and Jack was the original holder of the Ultimate Titan, mainly because his 13 years were up. Plus, he did unlock the ability that he can remove the curse of a mirror off of anyone. So, back then, his, ult his Ultimate Titan form was kind of weak. But Jason's is stronger. His Ultimate Titan form is a lot stronger. Here's, moving on. So, Jason became a proud Marlene for his family and wanted to protect the innocent lives. So, he became a proud Marlin and removed the curse off of Mimir, off of Pink, Galliard, and Rhyna. Oh, and Annie and Barrett's ult. But not Zeke. Mainly because he does not trust Zeke. He does not trust him. So, after the attack on Liberio, and when he heard that Gabby was taken by the Devils of Parody, he decided that he wanted to be the few to go to Parody himself. So, of course, he went to Parody, and instead of finding Gabby, he finds Mikasa. And he actually decided to get to know her. And since Mikasa didn't see him in his human form, she does not know he's the ultimate titan. So the two got to know each other. And Mikasa could up to say, like, why do you look like Aaron? And Jason replies, hey, it's not my fault. I was born like this. It makes her cut up to make a joke saying that, what are you, like Aaron's twin brother or something? No, I don't even know the guy. Pretending that he does literally not know him. So, Jason and Mixa spent some time together, got to know one another, of course, and eventually end up well, falling in love with each other. And it was eventually when Jason revealed that he is a Marleyan. He is the ultimate titan. But he also tells her that he's half Marleyan. His father was a devil of parody. Meek says it's like flat out shocked because he's half Marleyan and half parody. So she decides to not tell anyone what about this. And of course he got to know Mixa's friends, Connie, Sasha, Armin, Jean, and um Anji. He's not a he does not want to get to he does not want to know Levi because he does not like Levi. He he shares something in common with Vina. He he does not like Levi at all. So, yeah. So, Misa swear that she won't tell anyone one on who he is. As long as he does not try to do anything stupid. And Jason still has a mission, and that was to lure out Aaron Yeager and kill him. Mainly, he wants to see on how much more powerful he could become if he inherited the Founding Titan. So, of course, when Eren beat up Armin and hurt Nix's feelings, that kind of peed Jason off. So, he's just like, I'm not giving you another chance to live. I'm hunting you down, and I'm going to freaking kill you. I'm going to eat you right in front of Of your friends, so that way, way you can see on how disappointed they are at you. 
And eventually, he does end up fighting Aaron. But um, when Aaron started to use the full power of the, of the Founding Titan and started to summon all the Colossal Titans and started, yeah, started to flatten the whole world. Connie, Sasha, Armin, Jean. Uh, General Gath, Gabby, Valkyl. They all started to hunt down Aaron, friend, and eventually, Mink said her friends ended up declaring Jason as the new Aaron Jaeger. The Aaron that they used to know, because Jason is now grown. F He's basically now declaring them as his friends and doesn't want anything bad happening to them. So basically, they got Mink said in the others, they got the good side of Aaron back. Basically, they don't really care about what happens to the real Aaron. And Misa starts being a, a little overprotective of Jason, but he can handle himself. And Aaron, no, wait, not Aaron, Jason does kill Aaron and inherited his founding titan. And ends up becoming so powerful that he can control the powers of the Founding Titan. But declares world peace. And he does get married to Mixa and does end up having children with her. So Mixa is now officially Mixa Kruger. And she is now officially Pink's daughter in law. And. She does end up moving in with Jason, of course. And she ends up earning her place in Marley. And the same thing goes to Mika's friends. So, that is it. Folks, that is it for um, this profile video of Attack on Titan OC Talk. So, if you guys have any thoughts about... So, what do you guys think about how uh, Jason? you think he's pretty cool? Do you think he's a nice guy? Let me know in the comments below. <clears throat> Anyways... Hope you guys liked this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to have a Maya Gorgira with excellence. And I'll see you in my next video. And, oh, and the next video is going to be more like what if. Like, I'm basically going to do like a little video on Jason meets Fina. So, yeah. Anyways, hope you guys like this video, and peace out.